Hi friends, in this tutorial I am going to discuss about web layers. It is very important to understand about the web layers so that a web developer can come up with an effective or a good design for the website. There are three layers, content layer, presentation layer and the behavior layer. Content layer is also called structure layer. It is the foundation of a website. That means it consists of the HTML code of that page. Then what is HTML consist of? HTML structure con consists of text, images, multimedia, that is videos and sounds, hyperlinks that uses uses to navigate around the website. Here is a sample HTML code. This is the basic structure of an HTML page. You can see the HTML tags, head tag, the title tag, the body tag. Next is the presentation layer. This layer consists of how structured an HTML document is or how the content will appear to the site visitors. This layer is defined by CSS, cascading style sheets. CSS contain styles that determines how the document should be displayed in a web browser. Here is a sample CSS code. This code gives the paragraph color red and the content, the text, will be center aligned. Next is the behavior layer. The behavior layer is the layer that interact with the web page or that can respond to the user actions. This layer gives the dynamic capabilities and is accomplished by using scripts. Most of the web pages contain scripts and mainly JavaScript is used for this purpose. Some websites also use CGI and PHP to generate web behavior. Here I gave a sample script which resets the form element. So three layers, content layer consists of HTML presentation layer consists of CSS and behavior layer consists of scripts that is JavaScript, PHP etc. Now why we divided these layers or what are the uses of web layers? The first thing is resources can be shared meaning CSS cascading style sheet can be linked to many HTML pages and if you want to change any styles just change in the CSS so that it will reflect on all the HTML pages next is faster downloads first time when the user downloads a web page the script and the associated CSS will be cached in the browser. So if any other web pages downloaded in the same web page, it will download faster. The later downloads will be faster. A multi-person team. Many persons can be incorporated to develop a web page or a website. For example, CSS can be designed by one person, HTML can be designed by another person, scripts can be uh, designed by another person. Next is backward compatibility. Many of the older browsers will not support CSS or in some browsers scripts may be turned off. In that case, the basic HTML will be shown. Search engine optimization. If the web page contains clearly separated styles and contents, 
then it is likely to perform better for search engines. And thank you for watching. Keep watching. Please like and share my videos.